very early in the morning and then I feel like doing this again last night it is a very disappointed because of my internet connection it sucks so let me just continue here I hope I won't scare the shit out of myself Before we begin, there are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. Okay, while well, waiting for this, but there is shit. freedom. Oh, shit. This revelation. Oh, Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. So, you have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes. Sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Hmm? All right. We will start with a simple exercise. I don't want exercise. Could you please pick up a card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. It is essential okay. that you answer okay. honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. Okay, honesty is good. What do you think it is that makes you feel uneasy? I'm not sure. If it is something you cannot see, then why does it make you feel uneasy? I mean, is there something in the house? It's in the house. And this thing in the house, is it alive? I don't know. So, the source of your fear is elusive. <laughs> I'm sorry we're out of time for now, but I want you to think hard about what's inside that house and what it is that makes you uneasy, and we can unwrap it together.
Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Annie Klein was in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. This is an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Well, thank you for joining us, Andy. With all the Washingtons tonight, their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. Oh, that's... What is new again? All right. Hey, robot. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but... I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this and that I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together and I'm thinking of them. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and, um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sisters and, you know. Okay, so, let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this one trip we will never forget, all right? Yes! Did that this shit again. Something they will be the fuck. That's all light. Then what now? Oh, okay. Uh, I'm just I'm going to go safe. Just go safe. Fuck. 
Okay, I can do something already. Uh, 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 climb. Okay, this is even more creepy. Aww. Oh god, what's that? Hey little fella. You hungry? Huh? Ah, damn it. What? Hey, hey, hey. It's okay. Oh, I'm not supposed to move. That's it. Come on. What else? Okay. <laughs> Don't fucking scare me. Shit, my heart is racing already. Go. Oh, this shit again. I remember this shit. Oh no. Let me just adjust the camera. Better? Yeah, I think it's better now. Wow, graffiti all the way up here. bag are you hello what do we have here aha look who it is oh fuck I'm Game sorry, are, are you my secretary? I was buzzing. Cool, well, thanks for letting me know. I, I can take it from here. Oh, so, I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around here. Going to blow your mind.
Nice. You think we'll get a visit from America's Most Wanted? Looks like someone thought so. Oh, come on. This place is abandoned most of the year. Nobody comes up here. Ta-da. Pretty rad, right? Yeah. Come on. Look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? What do you mean? What the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of a ski lodge? Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Wanna try? Uh, now you go ahead, Grizzly. <laughs> All right. Here goes. I'm good at it. Okay, there will be some. Wow, nice shooting tits. All right, I'm bad. I'm a badass. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. Nah, no, I don't think so, girl. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Oh. Oh shit. Bullseye! What are you doing? How could you do that? Chris, that is so effed up! What? That poor little guy was alive about ten seconds ago! Oh, come on. Squirrels are just rats with bushy tails. I cannot believe you just did that. I'm sorry. Ah! Oh, oh my god, god. that's that! Get it away! Ah! Oh. Jesus, are, are you okay? This mountain is freaking me out already. Me too. Hey, hey, look. Our, our cable car is coming. Let's grab our ride. Okay. Oh, I hate cable car. Locked. Yeah, uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. After you. A oh, real gentleman. Crazy place to set up house. I mean, no matter how rich you are. They're not so rich. They only bought a mountain. There will be something. There will be something. Okay. Finally, you coming? Yeah, well, I was gonna stay here and catch some seeds, but. Seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to 
hotel with him, and I, I don't know, I'm kind of a little worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> you know what? Let's just, let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Ah, uh, you know what? You're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Okay. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like years early, and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off her train bra? I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. Someone is there. Jess. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. Oh, fuck. What the hell? Jess, hey. Jessica, over here. Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please. Oh my god. I thought we were goners. Another 10 minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look, I got a lot of meat on my bones. It's all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh -huh. Hey, Chris. <laughs> I'm just doing like Sam taught me. Other people's private thoughts are my own personal playground. Do not be a jerk. My goodness. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Mike and M split were together. Whoa. Drama. Not really. Pretty clear-cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Oh. All right, all right. Let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. Wait for what? Wait See for who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? Uh, I mean, you know, whoever. Uh-huh. Sam? Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge like right where the cable car ends? Emily. I don't think it would have been like as pretty. And where's the bellboy when you need one? <sighs> getting chills. We're almost there. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh, me too. Yeah. It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. Definitely not gonna feel like a regular party. I mean, what do you think? Ah! Oh, it's mine. Oh. Jesus! <laughs> Ah. Shit. <laughs> you guys. Michael. You really, really shouldn't see your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Come on, guys. You are. We're all friends here, right? You're a fucking jerk. No need jerk. for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? <laughs> Just trying to lighten the mood, Em. 
Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being. You always get like this. Michael. I'm a guy. I'm just gonna lay it out, otherwise this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, this is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Matt. I hear you, man. I get it. I don't want to make this weird. Cool. So we're good? All good. You guys gonna make out now? Oh my god, totally. We're so gonna make out. Uh, no. Seriously, I'm gonna go check on the cable car back down the trip. Right. See you, man. See ya. Right. See ya! Oh, crap. It's only like... What? Not even... Hey, could you... 30 minutes of the game. Take the rest of the way. And get a the shit off me already. Yeah. Just all the bags. Oh, um, why? I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just... I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important. Matt, please. All right. Fine. Oh. It's so important, I guess I can pack horse at the rest I of the way. I chose the wrong one. But you owe me one. I was wondering Excuse always, me? Huh? Well, the more even, at least. I'll think about it. Just be careful. See you up there, sweetie. Oh, shit. Thank you. No, I seriously chose the wrong one. I know what now. <sighs> okay, there must be something. Oh, hello. Oh. Somebody's getting a little friendly. And not in the friend zone kind of way. They might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. Oh! Oh, <laughs> hey, whoa. Oh. <laughs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Jeez you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real oh scare you. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Hey, well, man, I'm, I'm really sorry, Ash, Dan. It's okay, it's fine. Oh. It's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it, Let me check it out. I don't, I, yeah, it's kind of busted. It's not, it's not like really interesting. It's just. What? To, for real? I, I bet I could find like a cool bear chowing down on a fox or something. Uh, no, really, Matt, it's not worth straining your eyes. I'm getting kind of a headache just from looking through it, so just no. No. All right. Uh, sure, if you say so. Okay guys, I think that will be the first part. I'm wrapping up my part one. Uh I pretty much shit I pretty much shit myself already, so if you guys want me to like do more of it, let me know. Bye.